This is one of the biggest uh, sewer failures that, that we've been involved with. It's a 96 inch sewer line that failed. It's approximately 130 to 140 MGD uh, normal capacity. And we were asked to set up a system that was capable of up to 160 MGD to, to bypass it and control the flows during rain events. First call was to us because for probably two decades we've been doing bypasses for the city of Memphis. It was not just a simple task of replacing a line that failed. It was a major construction effort to establish a road and a lay down for bypass lines, probably in the neighborhood of 1,500 to 2,000 feet. We reviewed the site, reviewed the, the different hazards and obstacles that we'd be facing. Um, we came up with our plan. Um, and then we brought in our folks, uh, both teams. There was over 100 Public Works employees involved. Um, we had over 30 employees involved directly here. We started moving the excavation, moving the dirt, um, and then we started mobilizing equipment and men. We had to have the road built first before we could even enter the site. So the city broke off into two crews, and one was digging a 40-foot hole where we could do the suction, while the other one built the road at the exact same time. We built it, you know, 2,400 foot long, 40 foot wide, four feet deep road, um, basically through a swamp, um, and did that under, you know, some enormous pressure. We had to cross a levee. Um, we had to cross a creek where we had to install culverts and, and make a proper creek crossing that would be sustainable. So there, there was a lot of different things from the aspect of the access road. With Xylem's unique knowledge of this area and the sewer system, we knew that there was an access point where the, the pumps are located at. We were able to take that access point, set up our pumps there, route the pipe across the access road that we installed, and discharge into one of their gate structures about 2,200 feet away from the suction point. We mobilized 15 Godwin CD400s, uh, three Godwin CD300 hydraulically driven pumps, numerous people from across the country, as far away as Montana, New York, uh, all over the East Coast, and about 30,000 feet of high density polyethylene pipe to be able to set the system up and get it running. We found four different staging areas and put four different crews in there and started fusing 500 foot lengths of pipe until we just had them all sitting there ready to go and then drug them in place. Once we were able to turn the bypass on, we moved into the critical phase of 24 seven operation. We we're able to do that using two of our Godwin technicians on 12 hour shifts, 24 seven around the clock. Those gentlemen are taking care of the oil changes, the service. They're also watching the levels in the sewer line itself and adjusting the amount of pumps that are operating continuously throughout the day. When you can pump 160 MGD a day and have it set up in three days, it's phenomenal. I mean, it's like 22,000 feet of pipe fused up and in place in two to three days. And as far as I know, there's not many people that can do that. We pride ourselves at being a 24-7 company. We're always on, we're close by. We answer our phones at two o'clock in the morning. We can mobilize people, equipment, anywhere in the country that we need to. We've got a vast network of branches all over the United States and all over the globe. The response was extraordinary that we were able to pull together people from the City of Memphis construction side, pull together Xylem, and they were able to marshal equipment and get it to the site and we were able to uh, address the situation within six days. One of the benefits of having a turnkey solution on a project such as this, it allowed the city to focus our resources and our efforts entirely on design and construction and getting the pipe replaced. They were looking for a single point of contact that was able to manage, control, and drive this project with the sense of urgency that they needed it to be done.